Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Toast and today we are back with another Final Fantasy Brave Exodus video. And today we're uh, we're gonna do something really cool. We're gonna do the new dungeon where you're able to uh, level uh, not level up but get new abilities for your weapon. Uh, Steel Castle Malfikia. So we're gonna do this. Uh, we're gonna use the Glory of Evil already. You guys can see I did some of them. Uh, I basically wanna get this going, the glory of evil, see if we can get a little bit more magic on it. I already did the mass immune, uh, the bowie knife, I did uh, Mattius Malice, the one from Emperor, and now we're gonna do the glory of evil. Uh, things to know about this, alright? Uh, the earlier stages are actually really really easy, uh, the later stages are actually a little bit harder. And make sure, because uh, I screwed it up real hard on my stream. Uh, the party you're going to be using right now, uh, it's completely different than the party that you're going to be uh, using in the, the story quest or anything else. So, uh, let's say you're doing, uh, I don't know, in the vortex, you're doing something, then you come back here and you do it. Whatever you change on your characters in the vortex or uh, doing the regular missions will not change here. So, before I forget, we're going to change this right here. We're going to give him the bowie knife. Because I uh, I put a little bit more stuff on it, you guys can see. I wasn't super lucky, so I got some HP on it. Uh, actually, a lot of HP. So right now, our Nicole is looking really good with all this HP. We're going to give him some extra things. Also, uh, just before I forget, we're going to give him the Dream Waker. And that's going to be enough. Uh, Reagan, we're going to make sure that he's dual wielded. Because I forgot to put the Mass Immune. And right here, you guys can see, I got some attack stats for it. I went all out attack. I wasn't super lucky with the stuff that I wanted to get, but it doesn't matter, we're still good. And since you're, uh, I'm uh, using the um, Glory of Evil, well, I need to give my CG Sakura something to do more damage, because we took her away from her to uh, try to get more magic on it, so we're just going to give her Matios Malice right here. Uh, I basically got a lot of HP for it, and a little bit of magic, so 5% magic is not that bad, but she got a lot of HP. And uh, I'm gonna try to do a little bit more of that, but I just want to show you guys exactly how it works, uh, the things you can do. The earlier stages actually is super easy. Uh, the later stages, if you're not well prepared or you forgot to bring something in your party, could be a little bit uh, harder if we want to say so. Uh, the way your orbs refill, it's basically one every hour, so it's like the raid. Uh, so that's really, really convenient and really, really easy. Uh, something else too. Let's say, uh, my Bowie Knife, I'm not happy with whatever I got on it. Well, I could redo the stages with the Bowie Knife, try to get everything back. And at the end, let's say I got something better for my uh, Bowie Knife. Well, I can choose to whether keep whatever I got on my previous run. On my previous run. So let's say I got HP uh, 7%, 10%, and 5%. And on my second run, I get, let's say, MP 10%, HP 10%, and HP 7%. I could choose to keep the new one or basically uh, keep the old one, so that's really up to you. You can quit whenever you want, but know if you die, you're gonna lose whatever you got on your um, on your equipment. So right now, they're super easy, these levels, we're just gonna go through it. Uh, I'm actually gonna refill my orbs, just for the sake of it, to show you guys exactly everything we can do right here. So that's pretty, pretty easy. If you guys did it, please let me know in the comment section below. What weapons are you guys doing? You can do right now uh, daggers, rods, katanas, and uh, guns. So maybe I'll do a gun because I want to get uh, what's her name? I want to get some guns for uh, Veritas of the Light because her seven star can be pretty pretty good, and I want to get those weapons ready. Uh, I want to try to maybe get some attack and magic on it just because she's an hybrid damage dealer. So we're gonna see exactly what we can get there. Uh, that thing is really cool. I really love the RNG around it. Sometimes you get really crappy stuff. Uh, like at the lower levels, you're gonna get some uh, poopy stuff, which is to be expected. But see, right now we're getting magic 3%. These things are not that bad. Uh, take them because you want to build up as much as magic as possible. And let's say at the end of the lower, uh, the uh, at the end you're getting stuff that you might not like. Well, actually getting these uh, one and three, four, five percent right off the bat at the beginning uh, makes it a little bit more better at the end, if you want to say so. You're never, you're never gonna get a perfect run, so that's for sure. You don't expect to have like the best stuff right at the off the bat because it's not gonna happen. Also. 
Uh, if you do get similar skills, so let's say I get HP 10% and I get a second HP 10% on my second uh, stage or third stage, well, you will not be able to have two of the same abilities on your weapon. So that's why you're seeing a lot of 5%, 7%, and 10%, because you cannot have the same amount of uh, the same let's say magic 5% I can add three times there's no way I can add this three times so right now we're gonna be at 8% which is not that bad uh, especially considering we only did three levels I think so we're gonna refill a little bit of orbs we're gonna use this guy because the earlier stages are still super easy use item uh, wow well, I have 20 all right we're gonna use I think it's seven we're gonna go like this so the earlier stages are really, really easy. Don't be scared. Just go in it, auto attack, and you're gonna be good. And let's see what we're facing. Sometimes you're gonna face one or two enemies, uh, one or two uh, battles. So right now this guy stands no chance. He's completely dead. Boom, out of the way. Let's see what we can get right here. If we can get, uh, let's say, magic 10%, that would be really, really good. Uh, also, here's the things you guys can get. So, uh, on your daggers, if you are trying to get a dagger, the uh, let's say the best skill you can get is in the uh, eye type. So you're gonna get increased LB gauge fill rate by 100%. Uh, for katanas, you're gonna get seal of life and power level three, which is increase HP and attack by 15%. Uh, the rods, the best one you can get is basically increase MP and magic by 15%. And on the gun. The best one you can get is attack 30%, which is really sweet. Uh, the Bowie Knife. I'm trying to get High Tide, just because I want to give it to uh, CJ Nicole. Just getting that Limit Burst up and fast is actually the best thing we can do. So right here, uh, I'm, I have Spirit 3%, Attack 3%, uh, Spirit Auto Boost. I want none of these, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to dismiss those new abilities. We're going to skip them, and we're going to move on to the next one. So... Next floor, let's see what we can do. Uh, we're gonna bring this friend Titus right here. We're gonna go into the fight, and we're gonna see if we can get lucky and basically get some better skills at it. And let's see, it's still loading, it's still loading. How many people are we fighting on this one? Only one. So we're gonna go right here. We're gonna do this, just to make sure we kill him nice and quick. And he's gonna get done nice and easy. Also, there's also a point system, so the more event points you get, uh, the more stuff you can uh, basically unlock and get for free. Uh, you actually get a Bowie Knife for free, so if you guys missed on the Bowie Knife the first time, well, here's the chance to get another Bowie Knife in the game for free. Just by doing these things, you're getting points at the end of it, and as you accumulate your points, you get more star, uh, more stuff. And I think I'm actually pretty close to, pretty close to a 4-star ticket, so if I do get the 4-star ticket, Stay tuned, at the end of this video, we're gonna summon with that 4 star ticket. See if we can get our friend Awaken Rain, or any other 5 star that we might want, like Lauren, that I'm still going after. Uh, anything good here? HP 1%, MP 3%, nope. So we're gonna dismiss those new abilities, and we're gonna move on to the next one. Guys, as we're almost halfway through this video, because I don't know how long it's been, if you're new to this channel, and you enjoy the video, please consider leaving a like on the video and also subscribe for more because there is going to be more on my hand uh thank you for everybody who showed up yesterday on the stream uh on the friday i'm gonna try like i said to make it a uh, more of a weekly thing if i can uh, try to do it and uh yeah that was pretty cool everybody was there we're just enjoying this uh we tried the mom and dad bomb party which uh, went horribly wrong but still i'm working on a working on a way to maybe beat them as uh, easy as possible. But it's not easy, because you have to cover a lot of elements. But, your boy Toasty is working on it, guys, so stay tuned for more of that. And uh, let's see what we're getting here. Anything good? Tell me we get magic and MP 15%. That would be sick. Right here. Power of the mind. Alright, actually this is really terrible, but one thing I do love uh, I love the MP 10% so what we're gonna do we're gonna switch the ability so I'm gonna switch the magic 1% right here and we're gonna choose MP 10% boom just like that so this is basically how you change your stuff and at the end of the run well right now you're 
we were at what MP 10% and uh, HP 5 and 3 so 8% of magic which is not that bad uh, which we're gonna keep going like this and hopefully we can get that really 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 good one uh, which is the MPN magic 15% so let's see what we're fighting right here most of the time it's gonna be the same people so don't be scared they're actually really really easy uh, we're gonna do this instant flash I don't know how much damage you can take so we're gonna do quick thunders light quick thunders light and they should get beat down all right nice and easy nice and easy they're out of the fight and we're moving on to the next one uh, I was reading on the stuff and apparently the average chance to get the rare ability is around 12 rounds so uh, roughly 120 orbs so every 120 orbs technically this is where you get your chance to get the uh, best ability for your weapon which is rare some people might get them the first run some people might get them after seven weeks so it's always different for everybody but just know that it's gonna take a lot of time and a lot of tries before you get that good 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 ability unless you're super lucky which I'm not being really lucky right now because I got attack 3% spirit and attack 3% so we don't want this we want some magic give me some magic uh, this is floor 8 so we got three more floors and we're gonna be done after that so this is basically where it starts being a little bit harder uh, the last one is basically the hardest one technically if you're not prepared like I said if you are prepared it's gonna be nice and easy so let's see what we're going against right here all right this big dragon uh, I think I think uh, mr. Reagan and uh, mr. Sephiroth can take care of it really really easily so we're gonna do just this how's the dragon does the dragon's doing really good because it's done all right so we're gonna move on to the next one can we get a good ability can we get a good ability as i'm not a good singer sorry guys all right keep going keep going like i said these runs will take roughly around 10 minutes to maybe 12 13 minutes depending on how fast you're clearing it but it's really cool because it's new it's a really fun thing that they added to the game and i can't wait for them to bring it for large swords swords and stuff like that because trust me my brotherhoods and my excaliburs they're gonna get so much better so much better uh restore hp each turn spirit 15 percent and spirit 12 percent uh it's good stuff but it's basically not what we want we want something to boost our magic like almost the mass immune if you're doing your your katanas max out the attack guys we just go for the attack uh, this is what you want to do. You want to do as much damage as possible when you're using your katanas. Don't really care about your SPR unless you're going to be doing, uh, let's say, staffs and stuff like that where you can actually increase the SPR, which is going to be better for your healers because they're going to be healing more, they're going to take less damage, all this good stuff. So right here, we're just going to use reloads. Nope, we're going to go here. This dude. Uh, we're going to see if uh, we can boost our attack a little bit. I can't remember if this guy is... Can he take physical damage? I'm not sure, we're gonna see. Yeah, he takes physical damage. Okay, so we're gonna do this, and then we're gonna do this one right here. That should be enough, right? Is this going to be enough? Uh, I'm not sure. All right, we're gonna do this. We're gonna get some magic power into it. Come on, Sakura, do your thing. As my computer is lagging really, really hard. Alright, so already... Oh, okay, he's magic resistance. Alright, so already you guys can see on this turn, uh, the boss is a little bit harder. He didn't die first shot, but we're going to be able to take care of him nice and easy on the next turn. Uh, we just got to make sure our MP is going to stay up. So I'm going to use Nicole to do this right now. So, reload. We're going to use Nicole. Link stance. Because they do carry over the fights. So whenever your, um, your MP is starting to run out, uh, take note that it is carrying over the next fight so if you guys get to the last fight and your MP is at zero you're gonna be in a lot of trouble so make sure you keep track of that because every fight that you're getting up on the floors is uh, carrying over the, the last one so we're good we passed this boss he was uh, physical he was able to take physical damage uh, I think the last boss depending on the one you're fighting is a uh, physical resistant so hopefully we're not gonna catch this guy, so we can do a little bit more damage. Uh, last boss is uh, usually random, so we're gonna see. Can we get something good? Drop the gold! Drop the gold on me! Uh... Alright, this is crap. 
Uh, crap, so we're gonna move on to the next one. Hopefully the last one will be the good one, guys. Bear with me, we're almost done. Last floor. Let's see what we're fighting. Uh, we're gonna bring a friend, Sephiroth, because it's gonna be good. And we're gonna be able to do a lot of damage, hopefully. So let's see what we're fighting. Dun, dun, dun. The nervous. Being super nervous. Alright, this guy. Alright, if I'm not mistaken, this guy takes all the magic damage in the world. So we're gonna go right here. Quick final thunder. We're gonna use this guy. We're gonna break his stats, which is sweet. Dragon is so good because of that. Uh, is he magic resistant? I have no idea. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. Uh, can you do stuff? Yeah, he does magic. Oh, okay. So next turn, we're gonna be good. Here, we're gonna do Link Stance. Boost all our stats. We're gonna do this. Uh, he does a lot of physical, if I'm not mistaken. So we're gonna cover physical. We're gonna go here. Uh, anything else I wanna do here? Mm, nothing crazy. So we're just gonna fill our LB gate. Right, we're gonna do this with Sakura. See if he's magic resistant. Is he magic resistant? No, he's not. All right, so good. So next turn we should be able to do a little bit more damage. To this big All right. Oof. See. If you're not prepared, you hit really hard. So this guy's actually doing magic damage. So we're gonna try to cover this with Mr. Bosch right here. So we're gonna switch it up. We're gonna do dual white magic. We're gonna cast a Sunaga, which is right here. And we're gonna go Karaga. Boom. We're gonna do this. Ah, oh, he's so close. He's so close to the thing. All right, doesn't matter. Uh, here, we're gonna do this. Heaven's Wept. We're gonna chain them up. See how much damage they can do together. And then we're gonna cast it. Are we gonna kill him? Are we gonna kill him? Oh, that was so close. Doesn't matter. Guess what? CG Sakura will finish it. CG Sakura. Finish. The eerie goes. Done. Alright. Now that the floor is done, let's see exactly what we can get. And we get some light crisp. Yay, light mega crisp. Doesn't matter. We don't need this anymore. Alright. Go, 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 go. Let's move on to the next one. Let's put some hype music. I'm kidding. Let's lower it a little bit. I think my computer is actually pretty low. That's why I think it's super low. But it's going to be super high. So, how many points did we get? 2,500. Really good. And we're getting some, uh, some trust masters. Alright, give me the good stuff. Give me the good stuff, game. Give me the good stuff. Anything good? Alright, we got magic 10%. You know what? I like that. Uh, we're gonna switch the ability. I wanna keep the MP 10%. It's actually really, really good. So we're gonna switch it up. We're gonna take magic 10%. And we're gonna go boom. So our glory of evil got a little bit stronger. Uh, we basically got MP 10% on it and 15% total of magic. So this thing is actually a lot better than what it used to be. And uh, can't complain about that. That was actually a really good run. So like I said, you're not always going to have good runs. But uh, this one was actually really good. So let's see if we got our ticket. Did we get our 4 star ticket? Yes, we did. Alright, so let's go back. Fast, fast. We're going to go here. Claim that ticket. Because you have to claim your rewards. Go, go, go. Come on, game. We're going to claim that ticket, which is right here. And we're going to see if we can pop a rainbow down. Can you guys feel the luck? Can you guys feel the luck? Ticket summon. All right, let's go. After that, we're going to call it a night. Call it a night, even though it's the day. Okay, we got a gold. We got a gold. We got a gold. Can it crack into a rainbow? It's gonna stay gold. Alright, it's probably gonna be Schultz. And it was Schultz. It was Schultz. Alright guys, that's it for the video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. It was just something uh, not super short, but not super long. Uh, just to explain to you guys a little bit of uh, how the weapon system works. Uh, how you get new abilities, how you switch your abilities, and all this stuff. Uh, so, hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. Hope it was useful for some of you guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video, guys. And, uh, you know what? Don't forget, if you're new to this channel, please leave a like down below, subscribe for more, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.